Okay, James P. Madonna here at Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West Saddlebrook, New Jersey. The party room is well lit with the imported Turkish lamps. There we go, beautiful Turkish lamps. All right. All right, now let's see, let's see what I'm gonna eat. Because I definitely do not want to eat anything redundant. That's for damn sure. But then again, I gotta choose something exciting that I like. Oh, here you go, I might as well. It's my favorite sign. For the very finest in Buffalo hot wings for your next sporting event, come to Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey and buy them in bulk. Yes, you heard it right. Come in and buy them in bulk for your next sporting event party. I want to give a shout out to my good close friend, the Commodore Jeff Sambello and the Exorcist Bishop Brian from the hit show, Ghost Adventures on the Travel Channel. Okay, what am I gonna have here? Oh, look. Uh, what is that? Oh, no. Um, I thought it was Arabic rice. Now, the grilled chicken is actually good. You get a plate. I mean, my, my... Oh, Friday is here. Friday. The best day for you, the Friday. Best, the best day for, for... Well, it's probably the best day of the week. Yeah, well, you know. I don't know why that is. Uh, I think it's um, because I think because it's Friday, you know, you 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 get the biggest seafood shipment in, uh, something like that. I don't know, it's just a habit. You know, it's good when you uh, Sunday Monday. Remember when you used to put the big uh, em empanadas? Yes. Remember the chicken empanada? Yeah. I was the owner of the establishment and head chef. All right, this looks pretty good. You know, the last time, the last time I had it, it was nice and tender and marinated. Okay, this is gonna be a tough call. Hey, look what's back, crab soup. Chicken and rice soup? No, peasant, peasant food. Here's some sort of seafood soup. Uh, got the cockles going. Uh, mm. This is gonna be a, it's gonna be a tough call. It's gonna be a real tough call. You know what? I'll get the spinach or grunting. which is spinach with melted cheese. Spinach is very highly nutritious. Vegetable here. I'm sure I'll find something. So I don't, I don't end up eating a redundant... Uh... Any green tea ice cream today or no? That, that's, that's a great flavor actually. Oh well, not every week can be a paradise. Onion rings. All right. My friend is not here. Oh well, now the seafood salad is uh, lacking seafood, <laughs> too many, uh, yeah. too many uh, peppers and onions to be honest with you, no, no, the New Zealand green lip, green lip mussels are wiped out, um, 
Oh, look what's, look what's back after a long period of absence. Papaya. You know what? Females are pink, the males are, are a beige color. A little, uh, got a slim picking situation going on here. Let me put the sneeze guard back. Or bacteria guard or vi virus guard or whatever the hell you want to call it. Please don't touch with your hands. But you got you have to have an ample amount of product in order to uh, justify the sign. Okay, here we go, round two. Royal Abachi Buffet. It is, um, it's still mid-October 2019. The countdown to the Trifecta Memorial Holiday, my favorite time of year. All Hallows' Eve, followed by All Souls' Day, followed by the Day of the Dead. Day of the Dead. All right, here we got some fresh, fresh, Scrod card filet. Right. Fresh from Davy Jones's locker. All right, there you go. Succulent, and they just put it out, obviously. Yeah, a little more, a little more. Now, as a spur of the moment decision, because codfish is a little on the bland side, I have decided to flavor it with some bouillabaisse balls, I mean bouillabaisse broth, fruit de damar. Look at this beautiful bouillabaisse. Okay, get some shrimp. Probably, probably like a, a lemon garlic sauce, to be honest with you. We'll pour that right on top of the scarred cut. Got some mussels. There's calamari in there, but it's calamari rings. Got the North Atlantic black mussels. Some um, cherry stone clams in there, too. You can see some bay scallops. All right, that should be good. Huh, I don't have any any more room, but well, there you have some lamb ribs. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna come back. Come back for the lamb sacrificial lamb and I'm going to see if they got any bok choy no I don't see any bok choy uh, let me go to the salad area mariscos Mozzarella. Yeah. Yeah. Get 
some. Let's see what's over here. Last week, I did not partake in the eggplant. So, I think this week I am going to. Okay, a shout out to Sh Shirley Chen for scolding me for not eating enough vegetables. I'm gonna try some of this eggplant. If it is eggplant, I don't know. Or is it sweet potato? You know what? I'll have to find out. Got some yellow squash. A little cauliflower, or otherwise known as squish squash. And that's about it. These are just like different colored baby carrots on the other side. All right, that's it. I ran out of room. I was looking for the avocado salad that I love so much. Now I will make my iced lemon water. Squeeze some of the lemon on the codfish, which probably doesn't require it. Ah, there we go, the king of Mongolian barbecue. He's doing a, a special uh, di diet is uh, meal, low calorie. Yeah, a little bit of uh, beef. Got a little bit of uh, snow pea pods, onion, I think. Maybe uh, bean sprouts, maybe. It looks like a high protein, uh, low carb uh, Mongolian barbecue. There you go, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right, now. Got the lamb ribs going here. Yeah, lamb ribs. It's the old sacrificial lamb. Official lamb. Let's see what else I got going here. Well, I could get some crab soup. I don't want any new. I don't want any noodles. I'm starting to fill up. There's the cockle clams. Cockles of my heart. Right? I'm not a fan of green beans. Not a fan of green beans. I'm sorry. Take a quick look at the salad bar. Uh, let me see if there's blue cheese dressing. Well, I have no idea if there's blue cheese dressing, to be honest with you, because feta cheese, that's not bad. I don't know, they're not labeled, so I have no idea if there's blue cheese in here or not. Maybe this is blue cheese, let me see. Maybe. That might be blue cheese there. You know what I'll do? I'll listen to the advice of Shirley Chen and I will get, get some salad. Dark, dark green, some dark green leafies, right? And then, I'll put some feta cheese in, hopefully, what is uh, blue cheese dressing. 
how am I going to do this? But I'm making a mix. That's the secret. I think I'm gonna have to just put it in a cup. Now, this has to be fed. And I'll just have to take a chance and um, put it in a cup. Hopefully that's blue cheese. So I have no idea. I'm making a healthy choice this time. All right, I got some flan, piece of baklava, baklava. No green tea ice cream, so I guess Oh, no chocolate either. Um, it's it's going to have to be vanilla. Now, if I had Kahlua coffee liqueur, I would get, I would make a Kahlua milkshake. Uh, let, it be, let it be vanilla. Well, I could get strawberry, or I could get both. Actually, I could very well get both. What do they call that? Pralines or something? I don't know. Who the hell knows? Okay, let's see. Um, okay, I'm going to have to use two spoons because I'm respectful. I, I'm not the type to, you know, to mess things up. Vanilla with strawberry, and then together with a little baklava and flan. And flan. There you go. Nice baklava, flan. Strawberry with vanilla. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.